Τώρα που λύμει τη μηχανή στην εξέλιξη. That young woman is standing right on the edge of the cliff. I should check on her. Who are you? What are you doing? Stay back or I'll jump. You aren't the first person to try and persuade me. Easy. That is a long way down, even for me. It doesn't matter. Nothing matters anymore. The scorpion took my husband's life. There's nothing left for me now. You could find the scorpion that killed him and kill it. <laughs> Are you mocking me or trying to be cruel? Hey, even bitter laughter is better than death. Hey, why don't you step away from the ledge, huh? We can talk. I don't know what to say. Tell me of your husband. We used to come up here to watch the herons. Two of them built a nest together in that tree. We watched them bring fish for their young. We dreamed of our own children. And you are sad because you did not have any. You're not very good at this, Magi. You're not making me feel any better. There is no way to make you feel better. There is only tomorrow. And then the next day. One moment at a time. What you say is true. I just don't think I can face it. I want to show you something. I will return soon. Hey, try not to jump. There were some herons nearby, down by that tree. I've got what I need. I should give the feather to the girl. Careful, it's steep. Now you are worrying about heights? I've got something for you. 
This is for you. A heron feather? Why? It is a C1 ritual. Feathers mean a lot to us. Anubis will weigh all our hearts when we die against Ma'at's white feather. Yours, mine, our loved ones. I know what you're doing. This feather is for my afterlife. Your husband will meet you in the field of reeds when it is time. But it is not a place to rush to. He would want you to live now and be happy. Yes, you're right. He would. I should thank you for this gift. You can thank me by showing me the way down. All right, Magi, you win. This way. I'm sorry. I must seem childish to you. Ah, believe me. No. I understand your grief. That's why you knew what to say, isn't it? Did you lose someone too? Many have lost loved ones to the Ptolemies. Does it get better? It gets better. But you will never be the same. Yes, I already know that. What is your name? I am Tua'a. I am not from here. I come from Crocodilopolis. I am Baek, from Siwa. What are you doing in Soknopayo Nessos? You're from Siwa? I can tell. You're so nice. Your people are kind. I didn't want to waste my life sewing and weaving for my father. Then, I met my husband and we eloped. We didn't have much, but we were happy here. You could return to your family. They will miss you. You could be happy again. I can't go back to sewing carpets. Besides, my father will never look me in the face again. Few fathers would turn away the child they thought they had lost. Leopards! Bayek! Stay back. <laughs> We were dead. Are you hurt? No, but that was terrifying. Death isn't so desirable when you really see it. I guess I do want to live. <laughs> now she wants to live. <laughs> hey, that is good. But we should move before hyenas come for the carcasses. Could you take me to the docks? You have decided where to go then? I'll find that scorpion that killed my husband. <laughs> I think I know what to do. I'll head south, maybe even back to Kropodilopolis. I've always wanted to work at the theater. This place has too many memories for me. Do not forget your family. Your father will miss you, whatever you think. Here we are. Will you be okay? Thank you, Bayek. I will keep this feather and weigh it against my heart. Go do your hero work. Be safe, Dua'a. Go save the world, Magi. Who we hear? To where best wef? Wabe. Nienga out this. Where is? 
I should be cautious around here. <laughs> Nothing. Better stay sharp, though. What? That's odd. Sharp. Let's not get jumped. What's your bug? Adelphi! Trouble here! Watch my bug! Trouble! That's it! Hey, what? Die! I do everything I know. Who are you? A friend. Hold still and stay quiet. I will get you out of here. Gods, 
Thank you. Did Hotefre send you? No, but I must find him. I need his help to find the crocodile. Will you help me? Hotefre took a trader ship to Lake Moeris. It has a large statue on board and is marked by our symbol. The crocodile has hired mercenaries to find him. Then I must hurry. Get somewhere safe. Be well. of Siwa, styling himself as a Magi, is sought for crimes against the rule of our glorious Pharaoh. Orders to kill me. Those who hold them must die before I do.
That is a lot of guards for a simple storehouse. What? This must be the place. I have to get past them if I want answers. <laughs> the butcher will be nearby. What are these goons hiding? They took arm at the butcher's order. I guess we are common thugs now, not soldiers. Shh! Keep your voice down. Kamoto, this is not what I joined the army for. It is what puts grain on your table. You are here now. When the butcher says jump, we jump. That is how it is. Now shut up before someone hears us. Who shot the alarm? Over here! Oh. Be right there. Hold fast. Someone is asking for a fatal beating. I've got your back. We can handle any. Huh? Hey, what? Die, boy. <laughs> 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 More grain. The poor are starving while the rich fill their storehouses. This has to stop. I should keep looking around. Ledger entry is showing payments for grain. Huh. The butcher is not paying the farmers even enough to live. I need to find information on where he is. Ah, this is it. The butcher is in the villa nearby. It is time this butcher and I had a talk. Villa, built on the backs of Fayum's farmers, no doubt. As it is. Ah. Here's the Vlaka who's been messing with my business. We were just discussing you. You've been stealing grain from Fayum, starving people for profit. You're not from Fayum, are you? 
Your speech reeks of the countryside. That grain belongs on Egyptian tables. You naive backwater Malakia. I take orders from above. If not me, someone else will do this. This is business. People pay what they owe, or I take it. It's not personal. I'll give you a choice now. Leave me alone and live, or die here. Others thought the way that you do. Then they murdered my son. Everything is personal. You filthy Nekatiadet! What? Ends here. Guards, take care of this. May the Hidden One greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Morias Palaskevazma da Dudanestin. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ah, nu ga je het. Oh. Ah. Ga je possession gerecht?
This will be my death! Extinct. That was extraordinary. Well done. Who sent you? Was it Kition or Heraclides? They thought I couldn't handle myself out here, but we've shown them, haven't we? Have we? What are you doing out here? Are you joking, Neb? We are searching for the lost vault of the great Sneferu, the founder of the Golden Age of the Old Kingdom. And how are we doing that? Didn't they tell you anything before they sent you after me? Remind me. According to my research, Sneferu hid three artifacts in his pyramids. One in the Medum, his first and failed pyramid. Another in the Bent, whose design he obviously modified after the Medum's collapse. And one in his final masterpiece and tomb, the Shining Pyramid. I have one artifact, but those bandits stole another from me. You'll need to get it back for us. Where was this? The camp in the cliffs to the west of Memphis. You can find them by following the stream. Also, you'll need to find a way into the Shining Pyramid to get the last artifact. I think there's an opening high up, but it's quite the climb. In my youth, I could have done it, but... I will take a look. How many bandits were there? All of them, I think.
plain looking artifact must have some hidden value if it was stored among such treasures. attack on site here. Hey, what? Hey, what? I'm going to kill you! <laughs> artifact the bandit stole from Mercus. Strange thing. Time to find Mercus and see what these three artifacts are up to. 